Magic Chris, and welcome to So Cool Science. Science you can do right at home. I'm just having a sub today, and today's science file says, How does food get from your mouth all the way to your stomach? Swallow this. I, I, mean, I mean, try this. Okay, first you're going to head to your kitchen and get yourself a piece of bread. Hey, that's mine! Okay, now you got to stand on your head. Okay, now that you're upside down, Take a bite of the bread. Here we go. Whoa! When I swallowed, it went up my throat and into my stomach. Now what's going on here? Well, first, get up, get off your head, stand up straight, because when you go like this for too long, pow! You get like dizzy. All right, now take a look at this. The presence of food in the pharynx, or throat, stimulates swallowing, which squeezes the food into the esophagus. This begins a process where circular muscles in the esophagus wall contract and relax or widen one after the other, squeezing food down toward your stomach. These rhythmic muscle contractions are known as peristalsis. This is why astronauts in weightless environments can still swallow and is the reason why you are able to swallow while standing on your head. Food travels the length of the esophagus in two to three seconds. So, now you know how food gets from your mouth all the way down to your stomach. You know, eating upside down is why science is so cool. <laughs>